get up. Hey, come on, buddy. I want to go home. Come on, pal. Uh, my head. Listen to me. It's eight in the morning. Go scrape up your friend and get going. That friend? Patrick. Hey, what's up, buddy? Wait. You said eight o'clock. I'm late for work. Mr. Krabs is gonna be... Mr. Krabs. Now pay attention, Squidward. As new manager, you've got to keep a sharp eye out for paying customers. Yawn. What's this? King Neptune is riding toward the Krusty Krab at lunchtime. He's got money. Stay in the coach, daughter. This won't take long. Daddy, please, I think you're overreacting. Silence, Mindy! I know what I'm doing. Oh, Squire! Yes, Your Highness. Have this poll executed at once. A hundred and one dollars for a Krabby Patty? With cheese, Mr. Squidward, with cheese. Greetings, subjects. I seek the one known as Eugene Krabs. May he present himself to me at once. I'm Eugene Krabs, your highness. Would you like to order something? Hey! I'm on to you, Krabs. You have stolen the royal crown, you cannot deny. But clever as you are, you left one damning piece of evidence at the scene of the crime. I stole your crown, sign Eugene. Wait, Krabs! Relinquish the royal crown to me at once. But, but this is crazy. I didn't do it. Mr. Krabs, this is Clay, the guy you sold Neptune's crown to. Yeah, I just wanted to say thanks again for selling me the crown. Neptune's crown? I sold it to a guy in Shell City, and uh, I just wanted to say thanks again for selling me the crown. Neptune's crown. Which is now in Shell City. Goodbye. <laughs> well, I did. <laughs> eh, don't you just hate wrong numbers? My crown is in the forbidden Shell City! I love Clancy. Prepare to burn, Krabs. Please, Neptune, please, I'm begging you. I hate a crook. Ask anyone. That vouch for me. Very well, then. Before I turn this conniving crustacean into fish meal, who here has anything to say about Eugene Krabs? Mr. Krabs for many, many years, and always thought he was a great boss. You see? A great boss! I now realize that he's a great big jerk! <laughs> I deserve that manager job, but you didn't give it to me, because you say I'm a kid. Well, I Would you speak? 
spare Mr. Krabs' life if I went to get your crown back? You go to Shell City? <laughs> who's gone to Shell City has ever returned. What makes you think you could? You're just a kid. But I'm not a kid. I can do it. Run along. I have a crab to cook. <laughs> no! I won't let you. Very well, then. I'll have to fry you both. Daddy, stop it. Can you get through one day without executing someone? Mindy! I told you to stay in the carriage. Where's your love and compassion? Look at this little guy. He's willing to risk his life to find your crown and save his boss. But, daughter, I... Please, father, at least let him try. What have you got to lose? Might I remind you of your special problem? Give him a chance, but when your little champion fails to return, I get to splatter this crab all over the walls. Huh? And as for you, be back here with my crown in exactly ten days. You can do it in nine, eight, seven, six, Patrick. Six it is then. Four. Until then, the crab shall remain frozen where he now stands. No way! I'm begging you! Turn on the AC. Oh, Mr. Krabs! Oh, no, this is terrible. Who's gonna sign my paycheck? 